Hello everyone and the season's greetings. <laughs> Welcome to Stitching Ain't Easy. My name is Ashley. Thank y'all so much for joining me this evening, this morning, this afternoon, this Tuesday, this Saturday, wherever, you know, whatever, whenever. It's so, okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let me clear my throat. Sorry about that. Um, okay. So, thank you all, I said, for joining me. Um, if y'all are new, why well, hello, I have a few new folks again. I appreciate you guys so very, very much. Um, so if you're new, you've came on a good day, I suppose, because I have a project and I skipped, <coughs> excuse me, I skipped two, day two days and so more yarn, I guess is what that means. So, okay, cool. So, anywho, if y'all are new, either way, let's just shout her out. My beautifully wonderful friend, Angelia Crocheting House Mouse, and myself are having our third annual Christmas celebration blanket party. I don't know. Anyway, her and her husband are picking colors, making a blanket here in our house. We're kind of doing the same thing. So she's such a doll. She's such a sweetheart. If y'all have not checked her out, please go do so. <clears throat> Had the honor of chatting with her on the phone for a while. We both like to chat. What can we say? It's an absolute pleasure. <laughs> she's so fun. So she's so sweet. Okay. So so very sweet like just made my day all right so what is happening over on her channel um so her husband goes in and draws out some yarn out of we have two tubs like one that has variegated yarn one that has solid yarn <coughs> puts them in a project bag and brings them into her she opens it in front of us so it's a surprise to all of us at the same time which is way cool she has a couple cups that she draws some stuff out of and she like makes some things and then some things that she makes they like go on a tree and then some things that she makes jingle and so that's what I'm going to say and that's all I'm going to say so you guys please go check her out because she is so much fun her blanket is yeah like award for the blanket of the year goes to it's amazing. So I'm having an absolute blast. <clears throat> an absolute blast. Okay. Over here. Um, my hubby, three kiddos, myself, I'll have an evening. They come in and pick out the yarn, put it in our little tin. Poet didn't know it. And whenever it's my day, I just reach into the scrap ball of yarn and like randomly draw colors. Um, I would like to say that yesterday was one of the days I was supposed to do that. I skipped yesterday, but I did draw the colors out. Hosed once again. I don't know what's happening. It's just, it's not working for me. Each time I have not liked the colors I have drawn out, did it again. All right. So anyway, <clears throat> all right. So here's our blanket. So we're adding it, adding the squares. They, um, each pick out two colors. Activity, that we need to catch up on. I'm just going to be honest. Movies that a few we probably need to really catch up on. And then down below there's a playlist of music from the household. All right, cool. So, <clears throat> um, yeah, we're each choosing two colors. I'm adding them to trees. I will add that tutorial down below. It's, um, it's a really fun pattern <laughs> once you get the hang of it. I mentioned that a couple of times. Wasn't so sure at first. Quite like it now. Um, I'm kind of trying to figure out, like, it'd be really cool to make, like, a really, really big one. I'm sure there's a pattern somewhere for a really big one. It'd be a lot easier, but I don't know. Just, like, a little, or, like, a pillow or something out of them. So, okay. Anyway, doing that in between the rows, I am adding... It sounds like jingle bells because the stitch markers are holding it together because I need to make borders. All right. Um, in between the rows, I'm just making solid squares, which is a lot of fun. Um, I've just been reaching in and drawing those out as well. Although so far, 
<coughs> the rows have been like the top one is variegated solid variegated solid this one solid variegated solid variegated well, that makes sense this one variegated solid variegated and then I have a solid to pick put here and then the next color after that I drew out was another solid and so I'm just going to change the color um to a variegated to kind of keep that whole thing going just because so anyway the last we spoke was Lord of Dan's day and this is what he picked just pretend that the ends are sewn in thanks guys appreciate it this is his square <laughs> so okay <clears throat> it's really Dan Square. I really, really like this little row. <laughs> it's so pretty. They all just go together, and I don't know if it's neat. So then, this is the row up above it, the solid row. I said lots of stitch markers, some really cool ones from really cool friends that I have. Just saying. And then I'm going around each of the squares in. Um, red heart mistletoe. <laughs> How you doing? Red heart mistletoe, uh, red heart white metallic, and then a red heart mistletoe. So there's like a three row border on each square, and then just stitching them together this side up, like the right side up with a single crochet. Because I like whenever bumps or they all have that little like bump, a little like effect on it <laughs> the 3d effect i don't know i really like that look so i'm using my six millimeter hook i keep forgetting to say that during the videos sorry about that so now we know okay cool so <clears throat> here's what we have and then i will show you the colors that i drew out that hair though my gosh um anyway <laughs> i'll show you the colors that i drew out and then we will talk about things um, I have a project for you all. I'm, so my throat is feeling crummy. I'm not feeling real hot. So we're going to skip move or not movie. <laughs> oh my gosh. We're going to skip the story and things if that's cool with y'all. And then, yeah, tell you all the plan for the evening. All right, cool. So, <clears throat> blanket. <laughs> it's getting very heavy. I love. It. So, all right. It's obviously like getting very heavy. And then Derek and I last night were looking at it, and I think for the border, because it's gonna need like a really cool border. Because it's like wide, but it's not wide enough. It's gonna be somewhat long enough. It's just gonna be kind of a lapkin, really. But around the edge, I think it'd be really cool to use like a red metallic and then white metallic and red metallic and white metallic and somehow try to make it look like a candy cane like last the year before last the blanket i made the edges look like peppermint twist that was what i was going for anyway and so i thought that would be kind of cool to somewhat keep that going even though we skipped a year but make it look like candy canes around it just like red and white red and white we all think like all the way around so anyway because it's gonna need some cool something so but I absolutely love it. There we go, maybe. I'm trying to keep them where you guys can see it. There we go. How's that? <laughs> Still missing squares. Okay. It's amazing. I love it so much. Alright. <clears throat> so, set it right here. I don't want to throw it up on the bed because I don't want to mess it up. I have stitch markers in it. Um... Even though, know, whatever, life still happens and it's almost Christmas time. Christmas time, da -na 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 -na. you know, like the old peanut song. So, we need to finish Christmas, Christmas shopping. So, we need to finish Christmas shopping. Nothing like the last minute. Um, today is the 21st. I missed the 20th, which was my day. Um... So yeah, so 
so far for like activities and things. Um, wrapping presents, <laughs> we've done that. What ones we've had, like separate them all out, all those things. Um, so then tonight we're gonna go get the rest of the things. We just have like two, I think, I mean, you know, you say that. It's like, I have two more things to get. And then you're like, oh wait. And it's really, that's, it's probably like Halloween. Just to make sure you have enough Snickers and then you're good. <laughs> that's, this is why. <laughs> all right. Anyway. But it's the magic of Christmas. So it's all worth it. It's okay. All right. So for our solid color, like the in-between row. So the last one's variegated. So our next one's solid. So this is what I drew out was green. I'm going to take these with me. Um, probably snap a photo of the squares, although I have this as a reference also. Anyway, and then take those with me, stitch them together, and work on the other squares in the car. That's the plan. We're not going very far or anything, but they don't take very long either. So there's that. All right. Anyway, this is the solid color. Okay. And then... I reached in. This has been the deal. So I wasn't going to have my input in the blanket. I was like, no, I'm not going to draw colors out just because. And then they're all like, you should, AKA them being the family and my family, not like the family. You don't know what I mean? Anyway, just kidding. So anyway, I reached into the scrap balls and this is what I drew out. And it's like every time I hose myself. One time they were just green and red. It's like, I want to be just funky and original. One time it kind of was with that orange and the weird brown. I'll show you guys. But anyway, so I don't know what it is. Some sort of country blue and white. And I'm not sure which one's going to be the tree yet. I haven't decided. <laughs> so those are my colors. So yeah, that's where we are. And then I need to pick uh, variegated to add <clears throat> at the end right here but these are mine I drew that one I kind of dig this one I'm not gonna lie and then I mean just straight up as cliche as it gets <laughs> but that's all right well, okay so anyway before we draw out squirrely Dan's choice or no Finn's choice Squirrely Dan's was already on there. His is a pink one. Before I draw out Finn's choice, I'll show you my projects. My bag I've been lugging around the countryside. This <laughs> my mistletoe yarn and the white yarn and my six millimeter hook and other things. Just to get all the stuff. You know, you know the deal. You've seen a yarn bag. Anyway, so. Wanted to make everyone stockings for Christmas. Be asked if I would do that. So I have those. I wanted to share with you. I will share the other one in a different video, I suppose. Just because the allure of it all. And that way it's another project that I don't have to make. So there we go. Sorry, guys. Alright, but this one is Finn's. And I love it so much. It's so pretty. So this is Big Twist. I think sapphire but I'm not sure sorry y'all I don't have it in here anymore shucks let's see since they hold it up for all the colors it's right here no it's not there we go I'm still working on the background slowly <laughs> like slowly like it's it's taking me some time but we're doing it anyway uh yeah the color sapphire big twist sapphire is what finn chose and then this is that um just faux yarn from dollar tree the eyelash yarn just yarn yeah it's eyelash but the green one so anyway the kids are all gonna have the green tops and then derek and i are gonna have the red tops so this is Finn's. I'll put this pattern down below. It's fairly easy and pretty fun. So Bee's is really cool too. She has fun colors on hers. So anyway, um, but yeah, okay. 
I guess I can leave that out now. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, that's, that's Finn stocking. Squirrely Dan's is pretty blue. Also, Bees is something completely different, which makes sense to everyone, I feel like. Um, Derek, I think, is wanting, or Derek's is more like classic Christmas colors. Um, I'm gonna be real, I haven't made mine. I have no idea, I have no idea what I want. I thought about variegated, but then it's like, is that kind of dramatic, and is that a lot? And so, I don't know what color I'm going to use. And then I thought about baby blue, just because that kind of makes sense, but we shall see. There's already two other blue ones, so I don't know. All right. Anyway. They're magical tin. Our tin of yarn. So, they said, um, <clears throat> Finn puts yarn in here, and then... I will show you all tomorrow what his square looks like, say what he wanted to do for his day, all of those things. Um, for, for Squirrely Dan's day yesterday, he had to work, so that was another reason it's like, it's not a, that fun and stuff. Well, they have to work late, and then, you know, they just gotta come home and live life. Um, anyway, but yeah, we did have pancakes and bacon for dinner, so the kids made pancakes and bacon, they had that, so that was pretty cool. Um, yeah, so this song is, oh darn it, I had it. I don't remember. This song is linked down below. As is mine. They're all linked down below. I'm sorry, I don't remember what the heck it is. So yeah, alright. Here we go. <laughs> this is Squirrely Dan's. Or this is Finn's color. My gosh. Squirrely Dan's day was yesterday. My day, that was the other thing. For today, oh my gosh, that's what I was trying to say. Anyway, for today, my day, like I so said, we're going to go Christmas shopping, get the rest of the things done. Um, <clears throat> just like hang out after that, watch some Christmas movies, probably. Um, we still haven't watched Elf, which seems really odd. And so perhaps a little bit of Elf. Um, that sounds pretty fun. So, okay. Finn's colors. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'll show you guys first. Ooh. I was just looking at this yarn earlier. That's awesome. Okay. So this is like loops and threads. I don't even know. Highlighter yellow. I don't even know what we're calling this. I'm not sure which color he wants for his tree. I will ask him. We will all know together. I'll probably know a little bit before you guys, but you know, either way. This Red Heart Super Saver, Patty Green. That's pretty. They hide out. <laughs> oh, that's going to be really pretty. Okay, so that. <laughs> Next to my super lame color. Actually, no, it's not. They're not even close to my super lame color, so that's cool. I don't know what the deal is. I keep drawing out really random colors. Anyway, this will be his row, because I still need to add his other squares, so that's going to be another thing that I'm going to have to work on are the squares that go in between the next row before I can add this one in anyway, so, or at least one square. Last time I did it one square at a time. And that was a lot less stressful than like I need to make seven squares or whatever. So, but that'll go right there. That's going to be really pretty. All in a little row together. See, I knew there's a method to his madness. There's like the one and then pink on pink and blue on pink and then blue on blue and green on green. And I love it. That's going to be really cool. Not just madness. Genius. <laughs> He's awesome. So yeah, those are his colors. This is his stocking. There we go. Um, so yeah, we're not going to do the other things this evening. Sorry about that, y'all. But I need to go and get ready that, so that we can all go get last minute gifts. Because we are those people. Because... Just yesterday, it was December 1st. So, here we are. The 21st. How you doing? Um, anyway, and so that way I can also make the solid squares and all that stuff. 
So, all right. Please go check out my beautiful friend, Angelia. Hi, Angelia. I forgot to say hello to you in the first. It's so rude. I'm so sorry. I don't want to do that. I'm so sorry. All right. Please go check out Angelia and her super cool blanket. It's so neat. It's, it's so fun. It has to ice skate, you guys. Like, I just, it's so cool. The whole thing. It's so good. All right. <laughs> so thank you guys so very much for hanging out. Please go check out Angelia. I'm telling you at this point, especially it's the 21st. We're way past that whole, like, stay off the naughty list thing. We can all try for next year if you want. But we discussed the other day about... Like, what we're going to make with coal. So, like, just in case we get, you know, coal or whatever. Like, what you guys are going to barbecue. So, if you're on the naughty list, put down below <laughs> what you're going to bring to the barbecue. If, however, <laughs> JK, put whatever. And then if you're on Santa's good list, well, what do you want for Christmas? So, it's not very far. But also for next year. Perhaps it's too late for you this year, you know. Some years are tougher than others. It's cool. We all get it. But for next year, may I suggest to you all, suggest to you all, to stay off the naughty list. 